Hey guys, welcome to yet another informative video by About Technology. In this video, I will show you how you can slow down a video in DaVinci Resolve 18. So let's get into the software. So this is editor's interface. Right now, I'm in a edit mode. And these are two videos on which we will apply slow motion. Before editing and slowing down the video, let me tell you one thing. Always make sure that the video you are selecting for slowing down must be shot at a higher frame rate in order to prevent the jittery effect in the video when you slow it down. Let me tell you what I am talking about. We'll try out two videos, one with frame rate 25 frames per second and other with frame rate 60 frames per second. Now first, we'll select the video with 25 frames per second and drag it down to the timeline. Let me play it for you so that you can understand the difference after slowing it down. Now I'll copy paste the video clip and I'll make editing on the second clip and keep the first one for reference. Now to apply slow motion on this clip, right click on it and go to Retime Controls. It will pop up a speed up change on your clip at timeline. Now we can notice that right now the clip is at its 100% speed. Same for this one also. Now both the clips are at its 100% speed. Ok, now to slow down the clip, just click the down arrow and go to speed change. At first, I will show you what happens when I slow it down to 25%. Let's play it. You can notice the clip has a jittery effect and it seems that the frames are dropping. So it's always better that the video with lower frame rate must be slowed down a little bit only. So, if we slow it down to 75%, it shows a smooth motion. Let's play it again. Now you can see that the slow motion is as smooth as it must be. Now let us do the same for the video with higher frame rate. This video has 60 frames per second. Drag it down to the timeline. I'll copy paste this video so that I have one for reference and other one for editing. Now right click on a video and go to Retime Controls. Similarly for this, Retime Controls. Now you can notice both the videos are at 100% of their speed. Now I'll start editing this one. Click on the drop down arrow and go to Change Speed. This time I'm going to reduce it up to 25%. Let us play the original one and now the one after applying slow motion. As you can notice as the frame rate of this video is high, the slow motion at 25% is smoother, frames are not dropped and there is no jittery effect on the video. So I'll suggest always apply slow motion on a video that has higher frame rate. Hope you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and if you want to see more videos like this in future, please subscribe this channel. It will notify you whenever a new content like this comes out. Feel free to comment down below and let us know what other new videos would you like to watch in future. Hope you enjoyed this video. See you next. Bye-bye.